Thank you for inviting us to the Quick Logic booth. Could you tell me who you are, please? Hi, my name is Sam Masai. I'm a marketing director at Quick Logic. And what is it you're mainly demonstrating here? Okay, so today what we have this week is uh, Quick Logic has come together with SenseML to showcase a AI at the endpoint solution. We call this Quick AI. It's really meant to address the Industry 4.0 revolution, uh, where they're asking for things like predictive maintenance and factory automation. Okay? To deliver this type of solution, uh, these um, OEM customers need to have large-scale resources in areas where they don't typically have resources, things like data scientists, firmware um, engineering, algorithm development. The Quick AI platform addresses this hardware and software solution from end to end. Um, let me tell you a bit about the solution. There's two main pieces of technology in this solution. It's the low power SOC from Quick Logic. Uh, this is a multi-core um, SOC system where we include things like an M4, a micro DSP, an EFPGA, um, and as well as the SenseML data analytics toolkit. Now this toolkit is pretty magical. You feed it sensor data, time series sensor data, things like uh, Excel, gyro, microphone, temperature, humidity, and this toolkit will create the feature vectors in the algorithm model needed for AI at the endpoint. Now a vendor um, who's focused on making motors can apply predictive maintenance to it from this solution that Quick AI um, is able to deliver. And what have you got here? This is a, um, excuse me, <laughs> this is a great example of um, a predictive maintenance application. Mm -hmm. Here we have a motor, it's a, it's a fan, and you can see here that this motor has been trained to detect different states. We trained it on Excel gyro microphone data, sensor data, using the um, SenseML toolkit with the SOC from QuickLogic. Right now you can see that it's on, it's working operationally normal. So if I give it a shock here, we detect shock. Uh -huh, I if I give it a blade fault, we connect blade fault. Uh, we've trained it using the sensor data to detect different states. And in fact, that is what predictive maintenance is. So that looks quite impressive. So what sort of end applications could we use this? Obviously, sure. fans and motors. Yeah, so factory automation, uh, monitoring a motor, uh, I'm sorry, monitoring a motor um, state, bearings, um, things like that. Basically predicting something before it fails so you could be pragmatic and fix it before it fails so you know, so you don't lose efficiency, time and money. That sounds good. Thank you very much. Okay, great. Thanks for having me.